Hello YouTube, this error message is the one which appears after running a network troubleshooter. This problem is quite popular and uh, people are always looking for new methods to try out. We have gathered the working method we could find and put them all together in a single video in order to help you out. Ok, so the first thing that you need to try is updating your network drivers and to do so you will need to go to your search and type device manager. Ok, you will click on the device manager. Over here you will scroll down, go to network adapters and try to find something with Wi-Fi or network. In my case it is a Wi-Fi laptop, so what you will do, you will right click on it and then you will hit uninstall device. Hit uninstall. Okay, so the Windows now will try to reinstall the drivers by itself. You will need to right click on the desktop on the name of the computer over here and scan for end hardware changes. Ok, so the Windows is now reinstalling the drivers and this will be one of the solutions that you need to try. Ok, so another thing that you might try on Device Manager is right clicking on the Wi-Fi or your network driver and hit Update Driver, search automatically for drivers, so the Windows will search on your computer for the best available driver and install it on your device. Ok, so the best drivers are installed on my computer already. Ok, so the next thing you need to do is updating your DNS server or changing them. To do that you will need to go to the search, search for control panel, you will need to go to network and internet, network and sharing center, and you will click on the change adapter settings on the top left. Over here you will need to change it on uh, cable or Wi-Fi. So I will, I will change it for Wi-Fi, right click on it, you will hit properties, ok, you will need to scroll down to the IPv4, double click on it, and as you can see my IP address is automatically and DNS server is also automatic. If you want you can use it DNS manually and you will need to type 8.8, .8. hit ok. Click OK again and you will need to check the results if your Wi-Fi or network is fixed already and if not you will need to get back to the, to the automatic. Sometimes this problem may be fixed by this solution so you need to give it a try on that way. I will be changing this to automatically. Hit OK. Clear your DNS cache and reset your IP settings. So to do that you will need to go to the command prompt as an administrator, so go to search, type cmd, right click on the command prompt, run as administrator, and you will need to find to type ip config slash flush dns. Okay, so successfully flush the DNS resolver cache. Now you will need to type ip config slash release ok so the, the DNS is already released and you will need to find to type IP config slash release 6 ok it is performed and now IP config slash renew this will renew your Wi-Fi or network DNS address so this is all that we have for this video, hopefully these uh, solutions will work for you.